Hey y'all. Um, I know, like, I've been away for a minute, and honestly, my next video was supposed to be an update video on, like, what's been going on with me and everything. I came to y'all right now, like, it couldn't wait. Like, it's midnight right now. It's 12.18 to be exact, but, um, I came to you because this couldn't wait. I'm sorry the banister to my basement is in the way, but, like, this is one of the only spots where I'm getting good light. The other spot would have just been looking weird because I would have had jackets behind me. Yeah, I just finished watching an episode of True Life and it was I Wanna Be Straight. The title of it made me mad itself. I watched it and I got a little bit madder. Like, I couldn't yell at the screen like I wanted to because it was like 11 something at night when I was watching. It was a guy and there was a lesbian. It seemed to me like they wanted to be straight to please their families the guy came from like this strict catholic household had a catholic upbringing his whole life and he had been gay since he was like young and he was trying to live a heterosexual lifestyle and actually change and the girl she was a lesbian but i guess again to please to please her mom she was trying to be heterosexual and straight and date men. And it was kind of working for her for a second. She was dating this dude till she kind of cheated on him, not with a girl, but with a guy. This whole thing made me bat mad for two reasons. Number one, oh, number one, one. <laughs> if you're going to be switching all of a sudden like that, then um, either you're not gay in the first place or you're just pleasing others which is a lie to yourself why the hell would you care what anyone else thinks like okay fine i understand it's family and all but i mean if they really love you they will put aside all the crap and just love you like okay you're gay so what you're their son you're their daughter it, that shouldn't matter what who you like we're human i'm going to tell you like i tell the people who think they're superior to anyone else in any way we all shit the same, we all piss the same, shut the fuck up, really, <laughs> like, why do you care, um, like, your son or daughter being gay or lesbian is going to affect anything, you're worried that they're not going to be with God if they don't change their lifestyle, get the fuck out of here, um, God has nothing to do with this, okay, you, for the Bible thumpers, um, I believe God said love one another, that's what I'm sticking by, and I know there's some verse that's talking about um, if a guy, a, a man, lays down next to another man as if, as he does with a woman, it's an abomination. And like for the longest time, I have struggled with like the Bible and and gayness. I think somewhere in there is a confliction. Remember, the Bible was written by man, okay. But I feel like there's a confliction in there somewhere. It says it's an abomination, but then God says love one another. That's the way I'm, I'm just, it just confuses me. And I just live my life the way I, I, I live it. And I don't, like, kill anybody or rob anybody. But yeah, it just made me mad because you know good and well, if you watch this episode, you know that these, these this guy and this girl, they're not being true to themselves. You're gay, be gay. And if your parents are upset, then, I mean, you just gotta be who you are. You can't be living by mommy and daddy's rules forever. And for the girl, her mother was like, something's not right, something is disconnected, and God can help you fix it. Like, again, I don't think God has anything to do with it. I'm not disrespecting God. I love God. I praise God. I worship God. I am Christian. I doubt that... I mean, if you live a good life, you love everybody, you help people, you, you volunteer your time, you're a good person, you give the shirt off your back to anyone, and you're gay, I, I really doubt God would send you to hell for just that, and you've been living a good life. The, the bottom line is, it made me mad because the, these people, they were changing for other people, and I don't think that's right. I mean, if you're gay be gay if you're if you're straight be straight it's nobody else's business and it's not their decision to decide who you are and who you're attracted to sexually that is not their decision that's your decision and if they don't like it this is what they can do sit and spin i remember the first person i came out to 
was my best friend. As her little homework assignment, she uh, had me watch this movie called But I'm a Cheerleader. That movie, if you haven't seen it, was about this girl who um, had gay tendencies. She was sent to this camp so they could turn her straight because her parents didn't like it and they she couldn't continue to live that lifestyle under their roof. And she ended up being true to herself and getting kicked out of the program. This reminded me of something like that, like, but except for except for the people that were asked to turn straight actually did it. They actually listened to their families, which I think is like whack. Again, be happy for yourself, not for other people. I had to make this video because it made me mad and I just thought I'd share my thoughts on that because I know my LGBT fam out there, if you watched it, you're probably pissed off. If you didn't watch it and you just hear hearing what I'm telling you from the episode, go watch it and you're probably already mad by what I'm saying. But let me know, comments, agree, disagree, whatever. Comment section below. Um, and that's really it. Talk to me. I'm out.